afternoon. Today we are going to make, I thought, when I saw that book on the clouds, I thought what a great idea to make binoculars so that we can watch the clouds and see if we can be detectives and discover what the clouds mean and what kind of weather it's, we're going to get that day. So I'm going to make binoculars, cloud binoculars. I started by painting. Uh, you're going to need two paper towel rolls. You can use the little ones, the toilet paper ones, or the longer ones for the paper towels. Uh, I don't have any paint at home. So if you're lucky to have paint, you can paint your binoculars, your toilet rolls. You can use a marker and color in your toilet rolls. Or I have I found a bingo dabber. So I'm going to use bingo dabbers to um, make my toilet paper rolls blue, the color of the sky. So I'm going to tip it down so you guys can watch me do this. So I've already done my first one so I don't waste time. Oh, and I just thought of something else we could use. We could use um, food coloring if you have it. I have food coloring, mm, but at the at the moment I don't have a, a paintbrush, so I'm going to have to try and get one a paintbrush. So we're going to start off by painting or coloring. You can use pencil crayons, crayons, markers, whatever you have at home. Or if you don't have any of those things, maybe you've got blue paper or uh, wrapping paper. Or maybe even cello paper you can use. So you've got to get really creative and thinking about the things that you have at home. Or maybe you've got some felt and then you can glue the felt onto your your toilet paper rolls. So I've painted my toilet paper rolls blue and now I need to attach them so they could be binoculars like this so I can see. So you've got some choices. You can use glue. So you can glue, use a glue stick or liquid glue or I was thinking maybe even you can staple them together. So I'm going to put glue on the one side and I'm going to stick them together and just to be sure that they stick properly I'm also going to staple them. And if you have a stapler at home maybe mommies and daddies can help you staple them. So I'm putting my stapler in the one hole and I have to squeeze it a little bit so it fits properly and staple them together like so. So now they're connected and I've let mine dry. See, fingers are nice and clean. So if you're using um, bingo dabbers or paint, make sure you let them dry and then you are going to do the next steps. So we've got the toilet papers rolls together. Now we're going to get some cotton balls. If moms or dads have some at home, we're going to attach. I'm going to use my glue again and put some cotton balls to make our binoculars look just like the sky. So one there. I think I'm going to stick another piece there. I'm going to make this nice and thin, thin like I think those were the cirrus clouds. I'm going to have to double check. So I'm going to make my thin clouds and then maybe some puffy clouds on the other side. So I'm going to roll it up into a ball and put it on the other side and make them like a mountain. And those were the, oh, I can't remember the name of them, Mrs. K already forgot. I'm going to have to go back and look at the pictures and make sure I get the names right. So I'm going to put them on top, nice and puffy like a mountain. And then for the last thing I'm going to do, so that one's nice and puffy. And those are my clouds on my binoculars. I am going to use a hole punch and I'm going to press a hole here and another one here and I'm going to get some wool or if you have string or you don't even need to, to do this step if you don't want. But I'm just going to make, oops, get my scissors out here, cut my string and I'm just going to attach it so I can hang them down around my neck. 
so that if when you're going on a walk with mom or dad or in your backyard and if it's windy they won't blow out of your hands and you can put a string or wool and make it so that you can hang them around your neck if you'd like and these would be cool you don't have to just watch the clouds you can watch the clouds there we go all done uh, or you can try and do some bird watching I hear the beautiful birds chirping all the time and now is a really good time to be able to see them in the trees because they there's not a lot of leaves covering the trees so that's whoops our activity for today we're building cloud binoculars I see you okay I hope you have fun with this little activity and I hope you enjoyed the story by Eric Carl on the little cloud it was a cute little story and I think you guys can maybe if you're near a window you can lie by the window and look up into the sky and make create imaginary pictures with the clouds that are floating by have fun see you next time bye bye